everyone. So I just wanted to talk about why I've been so lethargic and under motivated the past few days. So I got a job in an industry that I was once told I should not work in anymore. Um, and for those who don't know, that's telecommunications, call centers. I was told that the job had stressed me out. It had previously given me high blood pressure, anxiety issues, sleep deprivation. Uh, so I was told not to work at the places anymore. But I went back anyways because I needed money. So I kind of tried a secret weapon for working at call centers. These are ALC, oh uh, no, CLA weight management uh, with green tea extract, or more importantly, they are pretty much caffeine pills. I actually was not using these too much for the weight management. I was using them more for the energy because if you were caught nearly dozing off at my old job, they would fire you. Point blank. So I was probably popping around six or seven of those a day. And here's what happened. Uh, after seven weeks of using the caffeinated pills, I hit a wall on week seven and just could not get out of bed. I actually thought I was dying for a minute. But... Then I talked to my friend who's a nurse, and they told me that I was consuming too much caffeine, and that basically I needed to cut out the caffeine. Ow. And this is why I'm having headaches. Lethargic. And I'm actually in pain. Just from cutting out caffeine, which I never knew could happen to you. I didn't know it would be painful to cut out caffeine. But yeah, I just wanted to make this video as a warning. Because after this, I will not be using caffeine pills anymore to manage anything from studying to going to work. Because it was brutal. I don't have my job anymore, although... Since I only had my job because of caffeine pills in the first place, that might not be the biggest loss. But, yeah. I don't recommend caffeine pills for anyone. Like, you can just look in my eyes right now and tell I'm in tremendous pain, just even with this light on. So, yeah. I don't recommend caffeinated pills. If you're in a line of work that tires you that much, you just need to know that that job won't likely last. Uh, I am looking at other industries other than call centers, like print shops, advertising, um, retail. Just something different that I can do. I know if I sit down for eight hours a day, I'm going to be tired. I'm going to be lethargic from that. It's not going to work. I'm the type of person who sits down for an hour anyways, and if he stays there, he's just going to pass out. So I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. But thank you for watching. Bye.